when to file ISF for Bungie. Every aspect of international trade carries a unique set of regulations and requirements. Among these, the Importer Security Filing ISF, stands out as a critical component, particularly when it comes to importing products like bungee cords. Understanding the ISF is not just about compliance. It can make the difference between a seamless import process and costly delays. At its core, the importer security filing, commonly referred to as ISF, serves as a pre-arrival notification to U.S. Customs and Border Protection CBP, ensuring necessary import information is available before a shipment arrives. In essence, the ISF is designed to enhance security measures within the U.S. supply chain. For importers dealing with bungee-related products, timely filing of the ISF is especially significant. Specifically, U.S. Customs mandates that the ISF must be filed at least 24 hours before the cargo is loaded onto a vessel destined for the U.S. This requirement is not merely procedural. It is a vital part of the trade security strategy. The ISF consists of specific data elements that must be submitted to CBP, including the seller, buyer, and cargo description. For bungee imports, accuracy is critical. Misrepresentation or incorrect information can lead to significant penalties, cargo delays, or even denial of entry. The filing process requires meticulous attention. To file an ISF, importers must collect all relevant shipment information, often collaborating closely with suppliers and freight forwarders. Once the data is collated, it is submitted electronically through the Automated Commercial Environment ACE, system, which is an essential platform for customs processing. For those new to the ISF filing process, pitfalls abound. Common mistakes include under-reporting the number of packages or failing to include complete addresses. Importers of bungee products should be vigilant, as these errors not only result in fines but can also trigger audits or inspections that delay delivery. Failing to file the ISF accurately, or at all, carries significant repercussions. CBP employs a strict enforcement policy imposing fines that can range from $5,000 to $10,000 per violation. More importantly, frequent violations may cause shipping rules set by CBP to tighten for the business in question, complicating future imports. Given this complexity, many importers choose to work with licensed customs brokers. These professionals specialize in navigating the intricacies of ISF submission and U.S. customs laws. Their expertise can prove invaluable, especially for those new to the importation of items like bungee cords, providing peace of mind and ensuring compliance. Another important aspect to consider is customs bonds. A customs bond is a contract that ensures that all duties, taxes, and fees owed to CBP will be paid. While customs bonds do not directly interact with the ISF process, they are a necessary component for clearing goods through customs upon arrival. Understanding how these bonds work can streamline your import process for bungee products. In conclusion, the process of importing bungee products into the United States hinges on a clear understanding of ISF requirements and compliance. The potential consequences of neglecting this obligation significantly overshadow the initial investment of time and resources needed to file effectively. By prioritizing accuracy, investing in professional guidance, and staying informed about customs regulations, importers can ensure a smooth entry for their products into the U.S. market. Thank you for being a part of this exploration into importer security filing and its significance within customs brokerage. Video disclaimer below, we encourage you to watch our upcoming videos for additional insights into international trade and customs processes. <music>